Hello friends, welcome back after a long time. Um, today I thought I'll make a video on the Kanban view and how to <coughs> enable that in the you know Salesforce Lightning uh, Lightning application. So, uh, what is Kanban view? Kanban is nothing but you know uh, the Salesforce has provided in the Lightning experience. Uh, wherein you can display visual summary of the selected records I mean you can configure that I'll show you how but it will be something like this based on which object you select either for the opportunities cases needs or whatever so it will show the summary of you know this uh, set of the records suppose if, if you select what are all my opportunities or all opportunities and if you, you know uh, group by the status or any other uh, big list field it will appear here like what is the in which stage it is right now and if you summarize by say a revenue it will summarize in this state what is the revenue so something like that so it has some limitations so some of them which we can call out is you know the it can display maximum of 200 cards in that and four fields in that particular card so apart from that i would say you know the mass actions can't be performed on the kanban view so that is one of the main considerations that you have to keep in mind while enabling the kanban view so let's go ahead and see how we can configure that so this is the i'll, I'll configure it for the cases so i'll go to case maybe i will go to all case my cases so here I have all these cases so let me configure Kanban view for this so what you have to do is that you may make sure you are in the lightning experience and uh, click this drop down select the Kanban and the moment you select you will get a pop up to group by field in the Kanban settings uh, it's taking some time Time. Let me go back and do it again. Okay, it's in group by field. Usually, you know, the pop up comes and you can select. Uh, I have selected that once and deselected so right now. So, if you come here, you know, the little gearbox settings tab and come here, select the Kanban settings. So, here you can select the group by field. In the group by, uh, I will select by status. Let's see. Uh, summarize by field is nothing but you know if you have any number fields populated, if it is null, it 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 will not be enabled. So right as of now, I don't have you know the, all the revenue and other fields populated. So that's why it's coming as null. So let me save this and see. So this is based on the status. New working escalated closed are the status and these are all the records uh, you know which are in that particular status so and also one more cool feature is you know suppose you want to update the status if you have edit permission you can drag and drop to working so by default you know uh, in the background if you check you know in the database that this would have been updated to the working status and similarly you can drag this and you know bring it to escalated it will be escalated in the background so that's how this kanban works so this is one thing and apart from that i'll show you how we can select the fields uh, select the fields to display in the kanban board so these are the fields which have been selected there are more than four fields but maximum only four fields will be available starting from the top case number contact uh, name subject and status so you can see priority date time opened and case on the alias but uh, those things are not being displayed here in the card so only the case number contact subject and priority is being displayed so only first four fields will be displayed whatever you have selected so that's how you know uh, the kanban card field selection works and apart from that um, these are all the other Salesforce related features. So if you again go back to Kanban settings, you can 
still select with some other you know file now I'll select type let's see how it comes out so it will be with the pick list so it organizes the pick list values in this Kanban board and then it also displays the records as a card in this particular board so this is how uh, basically it works in the Kanban and this is how you can enable in lightning experience Kanban. so this is pretty simple so I thought I'll make a video on this uh, so let me know your feedback uh, and if there is any questions you can put it in the comment box I'll uh, try to answer as much as possible and uh, please don't forget to subscribe uh, I'll be posting more such videos uh, thank you bye bye